don't even really want to start this vlog. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I mean, I do want to do it. I really, really want to do it. Okay. Here's what I want to do. I want to chop my hair off. And I don't want to cut it off because it's unhealthy or because like the ends are nat like too nasty. Like look how long this is guys. So the ends like they really aren't that bad. And my hair is really healthy overall. Let me show you what it looks like from the back. That's how long it is. It is pretty much like to my waistline. Excuse of the junk on my countertop. <laughs> this morning I was like, I woke up and I was like, I'm cutting it, I'm doing it. We have a cookout that we're going to this afternoon and I was like, it'll feel so nice to cut it and it'll be fresh for the cookout and like fall is coming and I need a change. And then after I did my hair, I was like, what am I thinking? <laughs> I'm actually crazy, aren't I? But I really do want to do it. Here's the thing. I feel like if I don't cut it right now, I'm going to end up cutting it later because I'm just tired of it. And I'm ready for a change. And I'm tired of doing something with it. Somebody asked me the other day, how do you get your hair so long? And I'm like, I'm ready to chop it off. <laughs> like, um... I feel like it's crazy for me to have long hair and all I do with it is wear it in a bun. Like literally 90% of the time I wear my hair up in a bun. I probably do something with my hair only on church days. And on Wednesdays I do like a bun on the side. So Sunday. So one day a week I do something with my hair. And then the rest of the time it's up in a bun. And I feel like that's pretty ridiculous. So that's why I want to cut it. But then I see it. <laughs> I don't know. I've cut my hair before. Before I started vlogging, like a couple years back, I cut my hair. And then I've trimmed it and cut a couple inches off since then. But, like, I'm wanting to go pretty short with it. I should do it. Okay. Hair grows back, especially my hair. My hair grow, can grow back like overnight. By the way, you guys may be wondering why I won't just go to the hairstylist. I want to really bad, but I don't want to do this myself. But they cost so much money. I called one hairstylist the other day and I asked her, how much it was and they said they started at $55 and I I just can't do that okay. I can't bring myself to spend $55 on a haircut okay so what I'm gonna do this is what I did last time I brought it all to the front I'm gonna look kind of silly for a little while because this is not attractive at all but i have no one that i'm trying to attract except my husband <sighs> okay we're gonna put it right there for now i think i'm gonna put a hair tie down at the bottom just to keep it all together <laughs> Hard to like stand on my TV so you guys can see. <laughs> okay, maybe I don't want to do this. Actually, I need to go get a pair of scissors, so I'll be right back. Okay, I had this all done earlier, and then my husband came in and I was like freaking out about it. But I think we're all right now. No, okay. okay, I don't want to do it anymore. I don't want to do it. Okay, 
So, I think I just about talked myself out of it. My husband like came in and was not happy with how short I wanted it. And then I said, can I cut it as short as I did last time? And he was like, yeah. And I was like, that's how short I cut it last time. And he was like, no, what? no it's not. And so I pulled up a picture from when I cut it last time and he was like, it is. He was like, well, then you can cut that at that length if that's what you want to do. But he just doesn't like the idea of me cutting half of my hair off. And that is pretty much half of my hair. So I was kind of like, okay, I'm not going to do it. But I can't, I can't not do it. I just have to. Um, I've been thinking about it too much and I feel like if I don't do it right now, I'm going to regret it and I have my hair straight and I'm just going to wish I would have done it. And I need a change. <laughs> so, um, Jimmy is all right with it. He's tired of like hearing the, should I or should I not? He's like, if you're just going to do it, just do it. I really like, uh, I'm talking a lot, but I love my hair. I really do love my hair, but I don't do enough with it. I just don't. Okay, so that's how much I'm thinking about cutting off right there. I really don't know how much that is. Well, I wonder if I should bring it down just a little bit more because when he straightens it out, it'll cut off even more. What am I doing? <laughs> like, what am I actually doing? I need that other hair tie. Alright, here I go. She blows. <laughs> oh my goodness. What do you guys think? Already? Here's the thing. My beauty, who I am, my heart is not found in this. This is not me. This is a part of me. And now it's not a part of me. <laughs> but this is what matters. This will always be here, no matter if this is gone. And it feels good. It actually feels really good. But the back is probably gonna look pretty bad. Jimmy will have to fix it up. I don't think it very straight. Of course, it'll be even shorter when it's curly. But I did it. There it is, I did it. I wanted to show you guys how, uh, how many inches that is. 10 inches. Let me see, make sure it's right there. 10 inches. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's a lot of hair. 
Okay, so Jimmy straightened it up in the back as much as he could. Um, I actually did a really bad job when I cut it, and so it was pretty messed up in the back. So he wasn't able to do it like completely straight. He kind of did like a curve, not a V, but kind of like a curve. So I'm gonna try to set the camera down and show you guys what it looks like from the back. And then I tried to add a little bit of layers, but I think I kind of don't want that much layers. I've, I've been debating, but I added just a little bit. I think you can tell. But yeah. There it is.